Okay, today we're going to be looking at uh, taking uh, still images and turning into animated GIFs and going back the other way using Image Magic, and it's actually quite simple. So here I have uh, 18 images. They're still images. Let me open them up here. And as I scroll through them, you'll see that each one is a frame in an animation I created in Blender. So those are, and it will loop around, those are 18 images as I click through them. Let's uh, use Image Magic to create an animated GIF from that. So here we are. I can list out. You can see all the 18 images. All I have to do is type convert, and I'll say asterisk dot png, and then name of my animated GIF. Now let's call it animated dot GIF. But you can call it whatever you want, dot gif. As long as you put dot gif at the end, it will know that you're trying to create a gif, and it's assuming since you're inputting more than one still image, it's going to create an animation for you. So now let's open back up our folder here, and you can see our animated gif right here. And we'll double click on that, and you can see it playing through the animation. And so that is our animated gif. Now, if we want to go back the other way, let's delete all these uh, still frames we got. If I can hit the control button properly, there we go. And delete all that, delete it all, delete, uh, yes, delete all, boom. Okay, so we have our one animated GIF right here. Let's go to our terminal. All we have to do is type convert, and we'll give it the name of our animated GIF, and then we'll say, what do we want the output to be called? I'll call it ball again, and you can do .png or .jpg. I'm gonna go .png. I'll hit enter, and if we come back here, you'll see that it created all 18 frames starting at frame 0 and going through 17 and it just names it whatever name I input it which in this case is ball uh, dash and then frame so we can go back in here and go through them one at a time now and that is converting to and from animated GIFs and still images using image magic uh, I thank you for watching and please visit filmsbychris.com uh, there's links in the description and the first link will be a link to a post on my site about this with sample scripts and uh, a place where we can chat about this as well. Thank you for watching and have a great day.